What you do, man? It's your boy Battle Truth coming to you live and direct from the Battle Truth headquarters. Let's get right off into this, man. So, Daylight, continue to let it be known he really don't want to battle Rum Nitty. He say after the loss that Rum Nitty had against Reed Dallas, he's not interested in battling Rum Nitty. He's not motivated. Rum Nitty battled too much. He oversaturating himself. He lost to Reed Dollars. Why should I battle? Because he's still Rum Nitty. He's still fire. He's still good. Even though he lost to Reed Dollars. Reed Dollars was the better man that night. But Rum Nitty is actually fire. Rum Nitty is actually good. Rum Nitty was actually good in that battle. It just got a little uh, repetitive with the um, Reed flips. But other than that, Rum Nitty was still nice. Reed Dollars just was the better man in that battle. And just because Reed Dollars beat him daylight don't mean that you can beat him. I know you're feeling yourself coming off this rock battle, redeeming yourself. The battle rap community want to see more of you. You promising you could do better than what happened in a rock battle. You calling everybody out. But you can't just overlook Rum Nitty like that. Like he just some pushover. Like he just some rinky dink. Like he ain't worthy. Like you just got so much leverage over him. Like he couldn't upset you. Like let's be real, bro. That rock battle you did daylight was the best daylight ever. You can't, you can't. I ain't saying you can't redo that and be better than that, but you haven't. Saying you can is one thing. Doing it is another thing. You never did it before. You act like you got a whole resume full of that Tay Rock type material. You don't have that. Let's just be realistic. You don't have that, brother. So promising us you can do better in your next battle than what you did in the Tay Rock battle. I ain't buying that. I ain't believing that. Or we'll have more of it from you. We don't. That's the only thing we have. And you've been out of battle rap for a long time, which means you probably had bars stored up. So trying to come at Rum Nitty because he lost the Reed Dollars, you can't use that as leverage for yourself. You can't say because he lost to Reed, you don't see no need to battle him when you just looking for his fault of a loss. You ain't looking at what his body of work been, period. How consistent he is all three rounds, how he continued to just be effective. You're not looking at that. You're not looking at how impactful he is. You ain't looking at all the battles he's been doing that was fire. And you brought up the LL Cool G battle. He was fire in that battle too. He was fire in that battle too. Really, would you get a bad Rum Nitty? Rum Nitty is fire in most all his battles, man. He more consistent than you are. And just because somebody else beat him don't mean that you will. Don't mean that you could. He might have a different energy for you. He probably wasn't motivated to go against Reed Dollars, but I guarantee you he, he'll be locked in on you. So I don't think that's fair for you to use that assessment that you don't want to battle Rum Nitty because he lost to Reed as though Reed just wasn't good that night. I can see if he lost to a trash Reed. Then you might have an argument. If you're like, man, Reed beat him with that trash or Reed was trash and you let him beat you. No, Reed was actually good in that battle and probably would have beat a lot of people that night on that card. He was the better man. But Reed beat Rum Nitty. You didn't. So you can't get credit off what Reed Dollars did. What can you do? What would you do? What are you going to do? I don't think you could repeat that. You could repeat that performance you did. Uh, against Tay Rock again. I don't think you can. That's the best rounds you ever had in your whole entire career. 
So don't make it seem as though you're going to pour it on worse next time. No, I don't believe that. Sometimes you can't repeat greatness. Sometimes it just happens. Sometimes it just happens. It's greatness at that moment, and you can't repeat it. That may be one of those battles that you just can't repeat because you were just great that day. But trying to underplay Rum Nitty to justify not battling him lets me know that you might be afraid of him. Yeah, you might be afraid of him. Because you know what's going you know what you might get. That's the only way I can see it. I can't see it no other way, brother. My back at you. You Charlie Cliff can't do this. Yeah, see, I refuse to believe that, bro. I ain't buying it. You say saying you can again, saying you can and doing it is two different things. So you supposed to say, oh man, my next battle, I'm turning up worse than that. Nope, I don't believe it. I think Tay Rock. Is your greatness battle. You ain't going to be able to repeat that again. I'm sorry. And if you battle against Rum Nitty. I got Rum Nitty beating you. That's how much I don't believe you can repeat that. You can outdo that Tay Rock show. I think Rum Nitty will beat you. I really do. I think Rum Nitty will beat you. Why not? You know, you know, it's you know, I got to take your I gotta use your words against you, Daylight, because you was asked the question about how dangerous the West is. And you were saying how the West could beat anybody. How like y'all got the best region. And you was naming everybody from the West, y'all top five in the West, from you. Geechee, B Dot, Nitty, Danny Myers. So how was it you underplaying Rum Nitty now when it's a possibility so close to that battle happening? All you got to do is accept it. But you stalling. Why you haven't accepted? Accept the battle. Prove it. Because trying to get credit off what Reed does don't help you. You got to do it yourself. That'd be funny how battle rappers say things like, oh, you lost to such and such. Oh, such and such beat you. Oh, this and that. But you didn't beat me. You didn't beat me. And nine times out of ten, you didn't beat him who you saying beat me. So don't say it like you beat him because you didn't. That's all I'm saying. I don't think you could use that as an excuse. But it is what it is, man. It's your boy, Battle Truth. It ain't my judgment. That's some question. It's yours. Hit the link in the description box. Subscribe to Battle Truth. I don't think... Y'all think they like an out top the Tay Rock performance? I mean, anything is possible. Don't get me wrong. Anything is possible. But the chances are unlikely he can repeat a performance like that from here on out. Now, anything is possible. I just don't think he can do it. Like he tried to make it seem so easy like he can do it. And I know Daylight do a lot of trolling. And he probably just trolling Rum Nitty, but also agreed to the battle already and just procrastinating time to have more, um, more time to write. More time to write. However... Regard to how he feel. <laughs> just because somebody else did it don't mean you can do it. And it's just simple as that. Just because Reed Dollars beat Rum Nitty don't mean you can do it. Because you have to do it. You have to do it. And we're not going to put Rum Nitty through these k Shine chest trials. Just so that he can prove himself worthy to battle you. Like he got to go through some type of task or obstacles to get to you. No. That's not going to happen. It's not going to happen, Daylight. No. No. 
No, 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 no. That's not going to happen, brother. We're not doing that. Um, but it is what it is, man. And this your boy, Battle Truth. And ain't my job and that's in question. It's yours. Click the link in my description box and join my Patreon if you ain't a member of my Patreon. I just put up the Sluggo Fallout me and him had. And I also uh put up the little weirdo dude who came on the channel on that perverted type stuff on the Patreon if you want to check it out. And it's your boy Battle Truth. It ain't my judgment, that's some question. It's yours. Subscribe to Battle Truth.